Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic that blends the mystical insights of Dolores Cannon with the profound teachings of Jesus. Have you ever wondered if your birth date holds a special significance? Well, if you were born on certain dates, you might be one of the chosen ones. Let's explore what this means and how Jesus' teachings can illuminate our path. So sit back, relax, and let's uncover this intriguing mystery together. 1. The Concept of the Chosen Ones Dolores Cannon, a renowned hypnotherapist and author, introduced the idea that certain individuals are born with a higher purpose. Her extensive research and groundbreaking work in past life regression therapy revealed fascinating insights into the concept of the Chosen Ones. According to Cannon, these individuals are reincarnated souls who have chosen to return to Earth during pivotal times to assist in humanity's spiritual evolution. They are here to spread light, knowledge, and healing, acting as beacons of hope and wisdom in a world that often feels chaotic and confusing. Jesus' teachings align beautifully with this concept, emphasizing that each of us has a divine mission. He taught that we are all children of God, endowed with unique gifts and talents meant to serve others and glorify the divine. Just as Jesus spread love, compassion, and enlightenment, the Chosen Ones are believed to be modern-day torchbearers of these same principles. If you're born on specific dates, particularly those that align with master numbers like 11, 22, or 33, you might have a unique role to play in the world's spiritual evolution. This idea isn't just about destiny. It's about responsibility. Being a chosen one means recognizing your potential to influence positive change and stepping into that role with intention and humility. It's a call to action, urging you to live in alignment with higher values and to use your life as a testament to the power of divine love and wisdom. By understanding and embracing this concept, you can begin to fulfill your potential, making meaningful contributions to the collective consciousness and helping to elevate the human experience for all. 2. Birth Dates of the Chosen Ones So, which dates are we talking about? Dolores Cannon suggests that those born on dates that add up to master numbers, 11, 22, 33, are often among the Chosen Ones. These numbers are believed to carry a higher vibration and spiritual significance. If your birth date reduces to these numbers, you might have a special mission. Master numbers like 11, 22, and 33 hold profound spiritual significance. In numerology, the number 11 is associated with intuition, spiritual insight, and enlightenment. Those born on dates that add up to 11, such as March 2nd, 3 plus 2 equals 5, August 3rd, 8 plus 3 equals 11, and October 1st, 10 plus 1 equals 11, are often seen as spiritual messengers. They are believed to possess a heightened sense of awareness and a deep connection to the spiritual realm, making them natural guides and healers. Similarly, the number 22 is known as the Master Builder. It symbolizes the ability to turn dreams into reality and is associated with great leaders and visionaries. Birth dates that reduce to 22, such as April 4th, 4 plus 4 equals 8, July 6th, 7 plus 6 equals 13, and 1 plus 3 equals 4, and December 8th, 12 plus 8 equals 20, and 2 plus 0 equals 2, suggest a strong purpose to bring about significant change and to create lasting foundations for future generations. The number 33 is considered the master teacher. It is a symbol of compassion, blessings, and altruism. Those born on dates that sum up to 33, such as June 6th, 6 plus 6 equals 12, and 1 plus 2 equals 3, September 3rd, 9 plus 3 equals 12, and 1 plus 2 equals 3, and December 24th, 12 plus 24 equals 36, and 3 plus 6 equals 9, are believed to have an innate ability to impart wisdom and to nurture others, often dedicating their lives to humanitarian causes. Specific birth dates also carry unique spiritual gifts and divine roles. For instance, individuals born on March 3rd, 3 thirds, May 5th, 5 fifths, July 7th, 
7 7th, September 9th, 9 ninths, and December 25th, 12 25th are often associated with particular spiritual qualities. March 3rd, individuals might possess exceptional creativity and communication skills, making them natural artists and storytellers. Those born on May 5th are often seen as catalysts for change, bringing innovation and progress wherever they go. July 7th birth dates are linked with deep introspection and spiritual wisdom, often guiding others through their inner journeys. September 9th, individuals are believed to have a strong sense of empathy and compassion, often dedicating their lives to service and healing. December 25th, known as the birth date of Jesus, holds a special place in spiritual traditions, symbolizing unconditional love, sacrifice, and enlightenment. Individuals born on this date are often seen as embodying these divine qualities with a mission to spread love and light in the world. Personal stories and biblical references further illustrate how individuals born on these dates may possess unique qualities and be destined for specific missions. By understanding the significance of your birth date, you can gain deeper insights into your life's purpose and embrace your role as a chosen one, contributing to the spiritual evolution of humanity. Jesus' life and teachings resonate deeply with the energies of these master numbers. He exemplified the qualities of enlightenment, transformation, and unconditional love throughout his life. Jesus embodied the essence of the number 11 with his profound spiritual insight and his ability to connect with the divine. His teachings encouraged others to seek their own spiritual enlightenment and to trust their inner guidance. As the master builder, Jesus transformed lives and created a lasting legacy through his teachings and actions. His vision for a world filled with love and compassion laid the foundation for future generations to build upon. Jesus' ability to manifest divine principles into everyday life mirrors the transformative power of the number 22. Finally, as the master teacher, Jesus embodied the energy of the number 33. His life was a testament to unconditional love and selfless service. Through his teachings, Jesus imparted wisdom and compassion, guiding humanity towards a higher understanding of love and unity. Understanding master numbers allows us to recognize the profound spiritual significance they hold and to see how these energies are reflected in the lives of those connected to them. By aligning with the qualities of these master numbers, individuals can embrace their spiritual gifts and fulfill their divine missions, contributing to the spiritual evolution of the world. 3. Historical and Cultural Context In biblical times, numbers and dates held profound symbolic meanings, deeply interwoven with the culture and religious practices of ancient Israel. This rich historical context offers us a lens through which to view the potential divine relevance of birth dates, connecting personal birth moments to significant biblical events and God's overarching plan. In ancient Israel, numbers were more than mere mathematical symbols. They were imbued with spiritual significance and used to convey deeper truths. The number seven, for instance, is pervasive throughout the Bible and symbolizes completeness and perfection. God created the world in six days and rested on the seventh, establishing a pattern that underscored the sacred nature of the number seven, Genesis 2, 2, 3. The significance of the number seven can also be seen in the seven branches of the menorah, the seven annual festivals of Israel, and the seven seals in the book of Revelation. Similarly, the number 12 is another example of numerical symbolism. It represents divine government and authority, as seen in the twelve tribes of Israel and the twelve apostles of Jesus. The number 12 is often associated with order, governance, and the fulfillment of God's will on earth. Dates, too, carried significant weight in biblical times. Key events in Israel's history were marked by specific dates that became ingrained in the collective memory of the people. For instance, the Passover, celebrated on the 14th day of the first month, Nisan, commemorated the Israelites' deliverance from slavery in Egypt, Exodus 12:14. This date not only marked a historical event, but also held spiritual significance as a symbol of liberation 
and God's saving power. The Day of Atonement, observed on the tenth day of the seventh month, Tishri, was another crucial date. It was a time for repentance, forgiveness, and reconciliation with God, highlighting the importance of spiritual renewal and purification, Leviticus 16.29.30. Understanding the symbolic meaning of numbers and dates in biblical times helps us appreciate how birth dates might hold divine relevance. If certain dates were seen as carrying specific spiritual vibrations or meanings, it stands to reason that being born on such dates could be seen as a sign of a special mission or purpose. For example, being born on dates like March 3rd, 3 thirds, May 5th, 5 fifths, or December 25th, 12 25ths, might be perceived as aligning with the symbolic meanings of the numbers 3, 5, or 12. The number 3 often signifies divine completeness and perfection, as seen in the Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. The number five can represent God's grace and favor, while twelve embodies divine authority and governance. Moreover, these dates might also connect individuals to significant biblical events. For instance, December 25th, celebrated as the birth of Jesus Christ, could imbue a person's birth date with profound spiritual significance aligning them with the mission of spreading love and salvation. By exploring the historical and cultural context of numbers and dates in biblical times, we can gain a deeper understanding of the potential divine relevance of birth dates. This perspective helps us see how our personal birth moments might be woven into the fabric of God's great plan, connecting us to the spiritual legacy of ancient Israel and its rich symbolic traditions. Four. The Spiritual Mission If you are one of the chosen ones, your spiritual mission is imbued with a profound responsibility and purpose. This mission often involves guiding others toward love, light, and a higher understanding of their own spiritual journey. According to Dolores Cannon's research and the teachings of Jesus, being born on certain significant dates is not just a coincidence. It is a sign that you have been entrusted with a divine role in the world's spiritual evolution. Jesus' teachings provide a clear framework for this mission. He taught us to be the light of the world, to love our neighbors as ourselves, and to live with integrity and compassion. These core principles are not just moral guidelines. They are the foundation for anyone on a spiritual path, especially those who are believed to be chosen ones. One be the light of the world. Jesus encouraged his followers to be a source of light in a world often overshadowed by darkness. This means living a life that exemplifies hope, positivity, and spiritual enlightenment. As a chosen one, your actions and words should inspire and uplift those around you, helping them see the beauty and goodness in life. 2. Love your neighbor. At the heart of Jesus' teachings is the commandment to love others. This love is not limited to friends and family, but extends to strangers and even adversaries. It involves acts of kindness, empathy, and understanding. For the chosen ones, this love is a guiding principle, driving their interactions and relationships. 3. Live with integrity and compassion. Integrity and compassion are hallmarks of a spiritually evolved person. Integrity involves being honest, ethical, and consistent in your values and actions. Compassion means showing genuine care and concern for the well-being of others. By embodying these qualities, chosen ones set an example for others to follow. 4. Guide others. As a chosen one, your mission might include teaching and guiding others on their spiritual journeys. This can be done through various means, such as mentorship, sharing knowledge, or simply being a supportive presence in someone's life. Your unique insights and experiences can help others navigate their own paths with greater clarity and confidence. 5. Promote spiritual awareness. Part of your mission is to raise spiritual awareness in your community and beyond. This can involve spreading messages of peace, love, and spiritual growth through various platforms, such as social media, public speaking, or writing. By doing so, you help others awaken to their own spiritual potential. 6. 
Heal and transform. Many chosen ones feel a calling to help heal others, whether emotionally, spiritually, or even physically. This might involve practices like counseling, energy healing, or simply offering a listening ear and a compassionate heart. Your presence and efforts can facilitate profound transformation in the lives of those you touch. Living out this spiritual mission requires dedication, self-awareness, and a deep connection to your higher self and the divine. It is a journey of continuous growth and learning, where every experience serves to refine your purpose and enhance your ability to serve others. Embracing your role as a chosen one means committing to a life that reflects the highest spiritual values. It is a path that can be challenging but also deeply rewarding as you witness the positive impact you have on the world. By aligning with the teachings of Jesus and the insights of spiritual pioneers like Dolores Cannon, you can fulfill your divine mission and contribute to the collective awakening and healing of humanity. 5. Embracing Your Role Embracing your role as a chosen one involves a deep sense of humility and grace. It's important to understand that being a chosen one doesn't make you superior to others. Instead, it signifies that you have a unique responsibility to share your gifts and contribute to the greater good. Jesus' teachings provide a powerful blueprint for how to live out this role with selflessness and compassion. Serve selflessly. Jesus exemplified the ultimate servant leader, washing the feet of his disciples and healing the sick without seeking anything in return. As a chosen one, your mission is to serve others selflessly. This means offering your time, energy, and resources to help those in need without expecting recognition or reward. Your actions should be motivated by genuine care and a desire to make a positive impact. Share your gifts. Everyone has unique talents and abilities. As a chosen one, you are called to identify your special gifts and use them to benefit others. Whether it's through teaching, healing, creating art, or simply offering a listening ear, your contributions can bring light and joy to those around you. Embrace your role by actively seeking ways to share your gifts in meaningful and impactful ways. Practice Humility Humility is key to embracing your role effectively. Recognize that being chosen doesn't mean you are better than others. It simply means you have a distinct purpose. Approach your mission with an open heart and a humble spirit, always ready to learn and grow. Jesus taught that the greatest among you shall be your servant, reminding us that true greatness comes from serving others. Inspire and uplift. Part of your role involves inspiring others to reach their own potential. Share your journey, insights, and experiences to motivate and encourage those around you. By leading through example, you can show others what it means to live a life of purpose and service. Your positive influence can help others discover their own paths and embrace their own roles as chosen ones. Create a ripple effect. Understand that your actions can create a ripple effect, influencing many beyond your immediate circle. Every act of kindness, every word of encouragement, and every moment of compassion can inspire others to act similarly. This ripple effect can lead to a broader positive impact, contributing to a more loving and enlightened world. Stay grounded in your purpose. It's easy to get caught up in the day-to-day -day challenges and distractions. Stay grounded in your purpose by regularly reflecting on your mission and aligning your actions with your higher calling. Prayer, meditation, and other spiritual practices can help you stay connected to your divine purpose and navigate your path with clarity and conviction. Build community. Surround yourself with like-minded individuals who share your commitment to service and spiritual growth. A supportive community can provide encouragement, accountability, and collaboration, helping you stay focused and motivated on your journey. Together, you can amplify your efforts and create a stronger impact. Embracing your role as a chosen one is a journey of continuous self-discovery and growth. It's about recognizing your unique contributions and using them to serve others and fulfill your divine mission. 
by embodying the teachings of Jesus and approaching your role with humility and grace, you can make a lasting positive impact on the world and inspire others to do the same. 6. Overcoming Challenges Life as a chosen one isn't always easy. In fact, it can often be fraught with challenges and obstacles that test your resolve and commitment. However, it's important to recognize that these trials are not meant to deter you, but to strengthen you and foster personal and spiritual growth. Jesus' life serves as a profound example of this. Despite facing immense hardships, he remained steadfast in his purpose, demonstrating unparalleled courage and faith. Recognize the purpose of challenges. Understand that challenges are a natural part of the journey. They are not punishments, but rather opportunities for growth and learning. Each obstacle you face can teach you valuable lessons and help you develop qualities such as patience, resilience, and empathy. Embrace these challenges as stepping stones that bring you closer to fulfilling your mission. Maintain courage and faith. When faced with difficulties, remember the courage and faith that Jesus exemplified. He encountered numerous trials, from temptation in the wilderness to persecution and ultimately crucifixion. Despite these hardships, he remained unwavering in his faith and commitment to his divine purpose. Draw inspiration from his example to navigate your own path with courage and steadfastness. Seek strength from within. Inner strength is crucial for overcoming challenges. Spend time in introspection, prayer, and meditation to connect with your inner self and divine guidance. This inner connection can provide you with the strength and clarity needed to face and overcome obstacles. Trust that you have the resilience within you to navigate any challenges that come your way. Learn and grow. Every challenge is an opportunity for personal growth. Reflect on your experiences and extract the lessons they offer. This process of reflection and learning can help you become more adaptable and better equipped to handle future challenges. Growth often comes from stepping out of your comfort zone and facing adversity head-on. Stay focused on your mission. During tough times, it's easy to lose sight of your purpose. Remind yourself of your mission and the greater good you are striving to achieve. Keep your goals and intentions clear in your mind and let them guide your actions and decisions. This focus can provide you with the motivation and determination to push through difficult periods. Seek support from others. Don't hesitate to seek support from others when facing challenges. Surround yourself with a community of like-minded individuals who can offer encouragement, advice, and solidarity. Sharing your struggles with others can provide comfort and different perspectives, helping you to navigate your path more effectively. Practice self-compassion. Be kind to yourself during challenging times. It's natural to feel frustrated or discouraged, but practicing self-compassion can help you maintain a positive outlook. Acknowledge your efforts and progress, even if things don't go as planned. Treat yourself with the same kindness and understanding that you would offer to a friend facing similar difficulties. Embrace change. Challenges often bring about change, which can be unsettling but also transformative. Embrace change as a necessary part of growth and evolution. Adapting to new circumstances can open up new possibilities and lead you to discover strengths and talents you didn't know you had. By following Jesus' example and embracing the lessons that challenges bring, you can navigate your path with courage and faith. Overcoming obstacles is an integral part of your journey as a chosen one, helping you to grow and fulfill your divine purpose. Remember that each trial you face is an opportunity to strengthen your resolve, deepen your understanding, and enhance your ability to serve others. 7. Awakening to Your Purpose Many chosen ones experience a significant awakening at some point in their lives, a moment when they become acutely aware of their spiritual purpose. This awakening is often described as a profound realization, a sudden clarity about their life's mission and the unique role they are meant to play in the grand tapestry of existence. Dolores 
Cannon's extensive work with past life regression and spiritual hypnosis has shed light on this phenomenon. According to her research, this awakening can be triggered by a variety of factors. It might be a transformative life event, such as a near-death experience, a personal crisis, or an encounter with someone who profoundly impacts your perspective. Alternatively, it could be a quieter, inner calling, a persistent sense that there is something more to life, something deeper that you are meant to explore and fulfill. Jesus' teachings offer timeless wisdom that aligns perfectly with this concept of awakening. He said, Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and the door will be opened. This is more than just a promise. It is an invitation to actively pursue your true purpose. Jesus encourages us to engage in a quest for understanding and meaning, assuring us that if we earnestly seek, we will uncover the truth about our existence and our divine mission. The Moment of Awakening this moment can be startling or serene, but it invariably brings with it a sense of urgency and clarity. It's as if a veil has been lifted, revealing a path that had previously been obscured. This awakening can be accompanied by a surge of energy, a renewed sense of purpose, and an overwhelming desire to live in alignment with this newfound understanding. Life Events As Catalysts Significant life events often act as catalysts for awakening. These can include major milestones, personal losses, or intense experiences that shake the foundations of your current understanding. Such events force you to question your beliefs, your goals, and your place in the world, leading to deeper introspection and ultimately an awakening to your true purpose. Inner Calling For some, the awakening comes as a gentle, persistent inner calling. This might manifest as a feeling of restlessness a sense that something is missing, or a deep yearning for meaning and connection. This inner voice grows louder over time, guiding you towards paths and opportunities that align with your spiritual mission. Seek, and you shall find. Jesus' invitation to seek and knock is a powerful encouragement to actively engage with this process. It suggests that the answers are there, waiting to be discovered, but they require effort and intention. This means dedicating time to prayer, meditation, study, and self-reflection. It means being open to guidance from various sources, spiritual texts, mentors, and even seemingly random encounters that carry significant messages. Embracing the Awakening Once you experience this awakening, it's essential to embrace it fully. This might mean making significant changes in your life, such as altering your career path, changing your lifestyle, or re-evaluating your relationships. It involves aligning your daily actions and decisions with your newly understood purpose, even if it means stepping into the unknown or facing opposition. Living your purpose. Awakening to your purpose is just the beginning. Living your purpose requires ongoing commitment and effort. It's about continually seeking guidance, staying true to your path, and being willing to grow and evolve. It means using your unique gifts to make a positive impact in the world, serving others with compassion, and spreading light and knowledge. By understanding and embracing your awakening, you can live a life of profound meaning and fulfillment. This journey is not just about personal enlightenment. It's about contributing to the greater good and playing your part in the spiritual evolution of humanity. 8. Spreading Light and Love one of the primary missions of the Chosen Ones is to spread light and love. Jesus' message was fundamentally rooted in love, loving God, loving ourselves, and loving others. As a Chosen One, you are called to embody this love in your daily life, bringing hope and positivity to those around you. Love as a guiding principle. Jesus' teachings emphasize that love is the greatest commandment loving God with all your heart, soul, and mind, and loving your neighbor as yourself, are central to living a life of purpose and fulfillment. For chosen ones, this principle is not just a guideline, but a calling to live and breathe love in every interaction and decision. Embodying love in daily actions. Being a chosen one means that your actions should reflect the love that Jesus taught. This involves simple, everyday acts of kindness, 
smiling at a stranger, offering a helping hand, or listening with empathy. It's about making conscious choices that prioritize compassion and understanding over judgment and negativity, bringing hope to others. In a world that often feels dark and divided, chosen ones are beacons of hope. Your mission is to uplift those who are struggling to offer encouragement and support. This could be through volunteering, mentoring, or simply being a positive presence in someone's life. Your light can inspire others to find their own path to love and positivity, creating a ripple effect. Spreading light and love creates a ripple effect. One act of kindness can inspire another, leading to a chain reaction of positivity. As a chosen one, your influence extends beyond your immediate circle. By living a life of love, you contribute to a larger movement towards a more compassionate and connected world. Loving yourself. An essential aspect of spreading love is learning to love yourself. Jesus taught that we should love our neighbors as ourselves, implying that self-love is foundational. This means accepting your imperfections, forgiving yourself for past mistakes, and nurturing your well-being. When you love yourself, you are better equipped to love others genuinely and generously. Overcoming negativity. Spreading light and love also involves overcoming negativity both within yourself and in your environment. It's about transforming fear, anger, and resentment into understanding, patience, and forgiveness. By addressing and healing your inner conflicts, you become a more effective conduit of love and light to the world. Inspiring through example. Actions often speak louder than words. By living a life filled with love and positivity, you inspire others to do the same. Your behavior sets an example, demonstrating that it is possible to live a life of integrity and compassion, even in challenging circumstances. Connecting with others. Love is a powerful force that connects us to others on a deep, spiritual level. By reaching out and forming genuine connections, you can share your light more effectively. Building relationships based on mutual respect and empathy fosters a sense of community and belonging which is essential for spreading love on a broader scale. Spiritual growth. The journey of spreading light and love is also one of personal and spiritual growth. Each act of love brings you closer to your higher self, aligning you more closely with your divine purpose. This growth enhances your ability to serve others and fulfill your mission as a chosen one. Global impact. While your individual efforts might seem small, collectively, they have the power to bring about significant change. Every act of love contributes to the overall betterment of the world, helping to create a more just, peaceful, and loving society. As a chosen one, your mission is to be part of this global transformation. By embracing the mission to spread light and love, you honor Jesus' teachings and fulfill your role as a chosen one. Your actions not only enrich your own life, but also create a positive impact on those around you, contributing to a brighter and more loving world. 9. Connecting with like-minded souls Connecting with other chosen ones can greatly amplify your mission. Dolores Cannon believed that these individuals often find each other, creating powerful networks of light workers. This concept is echoed in Jesus' approach, as he gathered a group of disciples who were chosen to support each other and spread his teachings. Similarly, finding strength and inspiration in a community of like-minded souls can enhance your journey and impact. The Power of Community Being part of a community of chosen ones allows you to share experiences, challenges, and successes. This collective wisdom can be a source of great strength and guidance. In the same way Jesus' disciples supported each other, you can find encouragement and motivation from those who understand your spiritual mission. Mutual support and growth. When you connect with like-minded souls, you create an environment of mutual support and growth. This network becomes a safe space where you can express your fears, doubts, and aspirations without judgment. The collective energy of a group committed to spreading light and love can be incredibly uplifting and empowering. Shared Goals and Vision 
Working towards a common goal with others can enhance your efforts. Whether it's organizing community events, participating in spiritual retreats, or collaborating on projects that promote love and positivity, being part of a group can make your mission more effective and far-reaching. Learning and Inspiration Each member of a community brings unique insights and experiences. By connecting with other chosen ones, you can learn new perspectives and approaches to your spiritual journey. This exchange of ideas can spark inspiration and lead to personal and collective growth. Building Lasting Relationships The bonds formed with like-minded souls can become some of the most meaningful relationships in your life. These connections are often deep and spiritually enriching, providing a sense of belonging and understanding. These relationships can offer a steady source of comfort and encouragement, especially during challenging times. Creating a Ripple Effect A community of chosen ones has the potential to create a significant ripple effect. The combined efforts of a group can inspire others to join the mission, spreading light and love even further. As more people become involved, the impact grows exponentially, contributing to a larger movement towards a more compassionate and enlightened world. Finding your tribe. Finding your tribe, those who resonate with your spiritual beliefs and mission, can be a transformative experience. This connection often feels like coming home, providing a profound sense of alignment and purpose. It reassures you that you are not alone in your journey and that others share your commitment to making a positive difference. Collaborative healing and transformation. Working together with like-minded souls can enhance the healing and transformation processes. Group meditations, healing circles, and spiritual workshops can amplify the energies and intentions set by each participant, leading to more powerful and transformative experiences. By connecting with other chosen ones, you create a supportive and dynamic environment that nurtures your spiritual mission. These relationships offer opportunities for learning, growth, and collective action, making your journey more impactful and fulfilling. Just as Jesus' disciples worked together to spread his teachings, you too can find strength and inspiration in a community of like-minded souls, amplifying your efforts to spread light and love in the world. 10. Living a Life of Purpose being a chosen one is ultimately about living a life of purpose, aligning with your divine mission, and making a meaningful impact on the world. Jesus Christ's life serves as a powerful example of fulfilling one's spiritual path and leaving a lasting legacy of love, compassion, and enlightenment. Aligning with divine guidance. As a chosen one, you are called to align with divine guidance and follow your spiritual path with dedication and authenticity. Jesus exemplified this through his teachings, actions, and unwavering commitment to God's will. By seeking to understand and fulfill your unique purpose, you contribute to the greater unfolding of spiritual evolution. Embracing your unique mission. Each chosen one has a unique mission tailored to their spiritual gifts and life experiences. Just as Jesus healed the sick, comforted the afflicted, and spread messages of love and forgiveness, your mission may involve similar acts of kindness, service, and spiritual awakening. Embrace your mission with humility, courage, and an open heart. Making a positive impact. Living a life of purpose as a chosen one means making a positive impact on those around you and the world at large. Jesus' teachings emphasized loving one another, helping the less fortunate, and embodying virtues such as compassion, integrity, and forgiveness. By embodying these teachings in your daily life, you contribute to the collective elevation of consciousness and create ripple effects of healing and transformation. Being a beacon of light, just as Jesus proclaimed, you are the light of the world. Being a chosen one means radiating light and illuminating others' paths with hope, wisdom, and love. Your presence and actions can inspire others to awaken to their own spiritual potential and embark on their journeys of self-discovery and growth. Living with gratitude and grace. Living a life of purpose involves cultivating gratitude for your blessings and gracefully navigating challenges and setbacks. Jesus faced trials and tribulations 
but approach them with unwavering faith and trust in God's plan. By embracing life's ups and downs as opportunities for spiritual growth, you deepen your connection to divine wisdom and resilience, leaving a lasting legacy. Just as Jesus left a profound legacy of love and spiritual teachings that continue to inspire billions of people worldwide, living a life of purpose as a chosen one allows you to leave a lasting imprint on the hearts and souls of others. Your actions, words, and deeds have the power to create a ripple effect of positivity and transformation long after you have departed this earthly realm. Honoring your calling. Being a chosen one is a sacred calling that requires honoring and nurturing. By dedicating yourself to spiritual practices, self-reflection, and continuous growth, you deepen your connection to divine guidance and align more fully with your soul's purpose. Remember, as a chosen one, you are part of a larger tapestry of existence, each thread contributing to the beauty and harmony of the whole. By living authentically, lovingly, and purposefully, you fulfill your divine mission and inspire others to do the same, creating a world imbued with compassion, peace, and spiritual enlightenment. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey, exploring the concept of the Chosen Ones through the lens of Jesus' teachings and Dolores Cannon's insights. If you've discovered that your birth date aligns with this profound idea, embrace it with an open heart and a willing spirit. Remember, your unique mission is a gift to the world, and by living with purpose and love, you contribute to the greater tapestry of existence. Jesus Christ's life exemplified the virtues of compassion, forgiveness, and unconditional love, inspiring countless generations to strive for spiritual growth and enlightenment. Similarly, Dolores Cannon's research sheds light on the spiritual significance of specific birth dates, inviting us to explore our potential as catalysts for positive change. To continue your journey of spiritual discovery and growth, we invite you to subscribe to our Balance Journey channel. By subscribing, you'll stay connected with uplifting content that nurtures your soul and deepens your understanding of spiritual principles. Don't forget to leave a comment sharing your thoughts and experiences, and remember to share this video with others who may benefit from its insights. Your engagement helps spread light and wisdom to a broader audience, creating a ripple effect of positivity and transformation in our world. Thank you once again for being part of our community. Until next time, keep shining your light and making the world a better place.